All right, testing objects for properties. Sometimes it is useful to check if the property of a given object exists or not. We can use the dot has own property and in parentheses include the property name method of objects to determine if that object has the given property name or not. So the has own property function returns true or false if the property is found or not. And below we're provided with an example which includes an object called my obj that within it has the properties top and bottom each containing a string so property top contains hat property bottom contains a string of pants and below the has own property function referring to my obj has been called to check if the property top exists and below that to check if the property middle exists. And as we can see here, the first has own property returns true, while the second returns false, meaning that the property top exists while middle does not. And below we are tasked to modify the function check obj to test if an object passed to the function obj. So obj will be one of the arguments passed onto our function contains a specific property check prop so a property will be passed onto our function as an argument as well if the property is found then our function should return that property's value if not then our function should return not found all right so let's walk through this right now so if our object yeah our object has own property check prop which is the name of the property passed on to our function then our function should return that property's value so it must return our object and check prop which is the property submitted if our property does not exist if our property simply does not exist then we add an else statement and our function should return a string of not found and i believe our function is now done it does what it's supposed to we don't have an object to check right now but we can run the test and see if this challenge is complete which i believe it is and there we go that is how you test objects for properties